Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be showing you the process of creating this holographic Dutch door and cozy forest squash painting. I start off by cutting out the shape of the door with my utility knife. Then I trace the outline of the cutout on the next page and cut out the second page as well. This will allow me to wedge in the holographic sticker later. I place the holographic sticker paper on a scrap piece of plastic. Next, I use acrylograph pens to draw in the stone surrounding the doorway. I roughly sketch a fox and a log for my painting. I don't usually sketch my outlines in detail. I tend to do a lot of improvisation for my paintings. I'm still very new to gouache and probably have only painted a total of about 20 paintings in gouache, so I still haven't quite grasped how to use this medium. Sometimes I add in too little water, and sometimes I add in too much. I find that I tend to prefer less water with gouache though, where I get a more opaque finish. I like how deep and rich the paintings look this way. I definitely still have much to learn. Bear with me as I figure it out as I go through trial and error. My main thoughts going into this painting was that I wanted to go for a cozy, serene feel, with a focus on sunlight streaming through trees, highlighting a fox napping in a patch of grass. I also tried to emphasize the contrast between areas lit by soft sunlight versus the surrounding shaded areas. I have recently been trying to incorporate more depth in my painting through adjusting the lighting, positioning, sizes, and shapes of the items I add to my scenes. As I like to hop from one medium to another, and I'm therefore learning several at once, I think it will take a while before I become proficient at any. Therefore, at this time, I don't plan to post any tutorials, but I do still hope that you can get ideas and inspiration from the work that I share. Here, I'm adding some metallic watercolor highlights for a more magical forest vibe. Adding in some simple signs with stamps and acrylographs, then I colored them in with some colored pencils because the stamps smudge. And now I'm gluing in the holographic sheet. Then I glue the two pages together. As someone who really loves sparkly things, I was super excited when this idea popped up in my head and just had to create this holographic Dutch door ASAP. I hope you like it as much as I do. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. See you soon.